What's up YouTube? My name is Mike. Welcome back to my channel. I'm going to show you a quick update that I figured out on how to prevent Fusion Studio by GoPro from crashing on your computer. Now this mainly corresponds to um, if you have logical processor. Um, currently in my system I have uh, 8 cores, 16 logical processors and the issue is when you are rendering or stitching together it tries to use all available logical processors and basically it's a memory leak I'll show you here currently right now I have it limited to only using 0 and 1 of the cores and you see my RAM is just pretty steadily I'm only using 25 percent of my CPU and she's stitching perfect but if you go in here and go to processes right click on GoPro Fusion Studio go to details right click go to set affinity I have it only set to 2 if I hit all processors and hit OK check out what happens this pegs my CPU at 100 which is fine because it can handle it but check the memory out it just keeps building and building and doesn't know when to release and so it gets to a point to where it just locks the PC up or crashes the software. And this is the issue that our people are running into. Uh, so again, to prevent that issue, you want to go to your processes, right click on GoPro Fusion Studio, go to details, right click on here, set affinity, uncheck all, and for me what works best is CPU 0 and CPU 1. I'm going to hit OK, go back. And watch my RAM start to drop down. I'm only going to use 25 to 26%. Now, what this is going to do is going to drop my RAM back down to standard normal usage for my computer. Um, and you won't have any problems. You won't have any glitches. You won't have any software lockups. Uh, some people say to upgrade or update your virtual memory. But that is false. Basically, that gets to the point to where it just crashes the computer and there's no turning back. You have to basically hard boot it, hold the power button, and shut it down. Um, the couple times that I did that, it actually corrupted the software and I had to reinstall the GoPro Fusion Studio. Hopefully, this will help you guys out on your video rendering. Uh, if you got any questions, hit me up with some comments below. Make sure you hit that like, hit the bell so that you get notified by YouTube when we put new content out. And again, thank you for watching the end of our video. We truly appreciate it.